Okay, I'm back from the farm. There's my good boy Rocky. He's my favorite cat of all, and my fav my favorite creature in the whole world. If you are, you know. I like those other creatures that I visit on the farm, and I go to work there, and I'm very happy to go to work there and to see them. But I'm even happier to come back here and see you, little man. It's true. Anyway, look, I don't give any of them treats like I do you. Look at that, hey, treats. Hey, <laughs> this is just for Rocky. He's such a good boy. These are his party mix treats. And he's entitled to have them because he's Rocky. Yeah, there you go. All right. Anyway, um, there's mosquitoes buzzing around in here, so I gotta do some. I gotta do some killing. I do. I do. I do. You can't have mosquitoes in here getting, you know, well, just doing stuff and buzzing around. We don't like that here. We don't like any buzzing around. If you're gonna buzz around, you can buzz off. That's right. There you go. I said it. Turn right, I said it. There we go. There's another one. It's carnage. Carnage, I tells you. All right. Anyway, that was some excitement. Um, here we go. Now, that, now, that turned out not to be mosquitoes. Just a weird paint chip on the ceiling. That was a mosquito ball. Every one of these I kill is one less to torment me tonight. That's the thing. I wouldn't be doing this except that they're an awful tormenting thing and you can't sleep. Don't even think of sleeping. Don't even think of sleeping when you got skeeters in your house. There's another one I killed. Yeah, I don't know. Those aren't mosquitoes. Those are just, well, those are, but they're ones I killed before. I'm just seeing anything that looks like it might even remotely resemble a mosquito is getting killed. It's a good thing Rocky doesn't look anything like a mosquito. <laughs> That'd be a, that wouldn't be good. Yeah. But there's no danger of any mistaken identity with Rocky. He does not resemble a mosquito in the least. Well, Rocky, you're wonderful. I have to go tomorrow and collect my generator. I'm kind of excited about that. I am. I bought a generator for um, $160. A Champion, uh, a 5500 continuous watt generator. And I also bought uh, a coin set. A set of Canadian coins. I paid $25 for those. And we have 13% tax in Canada, and we also have, um, well, with that auction, they charge a buyer's premium, which is also 13%. So I got my invoice. Uh, my total before taxes and buyer's premium was $185, but I have to pay 236 so there's over fifty dollars in taxes and um and and buyer's premium for that auction that's one thing i will say for the fella that i worked for the auctioneer i worked for is he didn't charge the people a buyer's premium um you know i mean he he wasn't a hundred percent honest and up above board or anything but he, he did not charge the people a buyer's premium anyway i i will say that um, but yeah, anyway, um, so yeah, it's like $51 over and above the final sale anyway price. But e even so, if the generator works, I got a good deal. Now, if it doesn't work, I got hosed badly. That's, that's about it. If it doesn't work, I got hosed badly, but I have faith that it will work. And if it doesn't work, I have faith that it can be made to work without too much difficulty. And we'll see if my faith is justified shortly. Anyway, in the meantime, all I can tell you is that um, it's time for bed. I've had an eventful day. I may be going to work tomorrow after I pick up my generator, depending on... Um, on um, well, depending on the weather, I have another job lined up for tomorrow. 
There won't be any videos from that job, though. So there won't be anything on the channel from that job, other than just now that I'm mentioning that I do have this other job coming up tomorrow. Um, other than that, there'll be nothing regarding that job. Um, anyway, that's it for tonight. Uh, I gotta go to sleep because I had an eventful day today, and it's going to be another eventful day tomorrow. My brake lights in my truck wouldn't wouldn't shut off. They they were staying on. So I got in under the dashboard and I had a look. It turns out it's the brake light switch was sticking. So I pulled up on the brake pedal and that made the brake lights go out. And now they seem to be working fine. But I'm going to have to keep an eye on it because if it was sticking once it, w it could start sticking again. So I will need to keep an eye on it anyway. And if it winds up. If it winds up being an ongoing issue, then I'll have to replace the brake light switch because that's uh, a safety concern, you know, because when the brake lights are just on continuously, um, then people behind you don't know that you're braking, you know, because the light it doesn't change. They don't get any brighter. So that that's the reason anyway that it, it can't be doing that because if it starts doing that and I'm not aware it's doing it, I may get ass ended. By somebody you know I was lucky that didn't happen on the way home today this afternoon anyway that's where we're at that's what's going on um, I reckon we'll talk to you all later tonight and um, I hope you're all doing well we'll talk later bye bye